without um Taylor. Like Test. the previous previous place I learned, I felt like the man didn't teach me well. So that's why my mom actually told me that I should come here. So yeah, that's why you need to come to places like this where you can know more and more about the job. So I will use that to show you how to take complete measurements. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So unisex, right? Yeah. Um first it will be the one that is most difficult. Okay, even without learning, you can sew male clothes, children yeah. clothes. But the one that is most difficult is ladies, female clothes. Yeah. Ah, very, very hard. But the first thing you need to know will be the measurement. If the measurement is accurate, you are done. Mm. So if you have the right measurement, even when you are not here, you just try the measurement and keep and go on your off day and whatever before you come back. I can click and also I'll finish it. Mm. She can pick it, anybody yeah. can. But the measurement is essential. Essential. So to have the female clothes made, first you start with the full measurement. Okay. So you start from the right again, coming all through to the left, and then you look at what number that you have. Yeah. Should I write it down? No, no, it's, it's okay. It's okay. Just pay attention. Okay. Sometimes as a professional, you might not even need to write it. I can take the full measurement without even writing anything. Mm. You know, but sometimes this measurement can be in diameter, sometimes it can be in speedometer, sometimes in kilometer, you know, sometimes it can even come in kilograms. Yeah. You know, so the measurements are very, very essential to pay attention to. You know, for female dress, sometimes you can measure the center line. Mm. Okay, you yes. measure the center line, yes. which is also perfect. Yes. Now, the law will call allowance. Okay. Now, if you sew somebody's clothes like this, I don't give allowance. The cloth can easily have issues. Okay. Oh. So, okay. for you to have allowance, sometimes you can have the customer like this. Okay. This is called allowance measurement. Okay. Allowance okay. measurement. Yes. yes. So, when the person wears the cloth, it will be so tight. To now come and tear or something. So now there's now what we call the back measurement. Okay. So you can also take full measurement with allowance from the back. The back. Okay, pay attention. If you don't pay attention. I'm you paying attention. The trouble. I'm paying so you can attention. measure the full allowance from the back. So at the moment, myself, I'll get it. You get everything mm -hmm. right. Okay. Okay. So you can also measure from the back without allowance. Yes. So if the cloth is elastic, then you don't need the allowance. Yeah. But if it's like jean, you know, and cara, then you add the allowance. Yeah. If you spoil somebody's clothes and they bring soldier to this shop, I'll just carry you and you know, I'll, I'll watch and learn. Watch and learn. She has been here for a long watch time and, 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 and she has known everything about the job. So this is basically the foundation of the tailor, yeah. especially when it comes to Women, so, okay. So that's what you need to know. Yes, Go and carry the broom and clean the shop now. Yes, sir. You cut, take the measurement and cut the clothes I asked you to cut this morning. So I'll be, I'll be back in the yes, 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 y